Howdy folks, this is Checkers back again with another edition of our Fallout 4 Let's Play, this time with episode 119, which sees us starting out inside the Institute in the aftermath of our last visit. And there are oh so many things to look at. I have not looted any of them for the most part. Stimpak Mentat's there. And uh I don't think if I had a herd of Brahmin, I could loot everything that is on them. But we'll go through their ammo, maybe. See if there's anything incredibly unique. Maybe a legendary weapon here and there. But, you know, I think... Oh. Ah, bottle cap, fusion cell... And yeah. fusion cells, stim pack. Ten fusion cells, five shotgun shells, nine fusion cells, fourteen five millimeter rounds, eight fusion cells, six fusion cells, nine forty five rounds. There are a world of you folks. Fusion cells by twelve, fusion cells by nine, five millimeter rounds by fourteen. Actually, I'm going to stop reading them because it's going to take forever. But if we find something legendary. Well, look in on it. Uh, okay. Oh my. So many bits and pieces. Nuclear material, we can grab that. We would be quite wealthy. Night vision maximized institute rifle. Sure, we'll grab that. Take a look at it at some point. Oh my. They're, they they had quite a few of these keyword being had improved focused overcharged yeah lots of words don't look like any of them are very interesting oops okay Night Vision Fiery Institute Pistol, that could be fun. Oh. Night Vision Fiery Institute Rifle, sure, why not? Improved something or other. There are just so many. And... I wonder how the world is going to react to all of this. Now that things have changed a bit, part of me thinks not much is going to happen. Part of me thinks there might be some broken things we'll have to work around at some point. What if it'll let us go back down? Just out of curiosity. In case we left anyone alive. I mean, um, yeah, that's pretty much what I mean. Interesting that they're letting us go back down. I wonder if it's going to stop at the main floor or go all the way down to Father. Or, you know, what's left of him anyway. And yes, I am aware of who Father may or may not be. But... You know, the Institute has been responsible for murder and kidnapping. Oh, hello! Hang on, we need to be prepared for this moment in time. Stand by. Stand by. Fire. Whoa. You kids survived that, huh? Let me fix that for you. 
There you go. Another level. I guess it always pays to check behind you. Okay, gonna have to fix this. Oh, that guy survived that. Yeah, you always have to check your targets, folks. And we are going to need to go back to the Fat Man. The Battle of the Institute is not over. Look at him line up. Another level. Wow. You know, I'm... Uh, on the plus side, it's really good for experience. Whoa, look at you run. Aren't you special? What are you going to do? Bleed on me? Okay, kind of wonder if they're just spawning indefinitely at this point, but... Yeah, this would be a waste for just two. Okay, and back to Fat Man, losing our leg there. Reloaded last round for the fat man. Oh, I get the feeling that did not get maximum effect. Well. Well, well, well. I think that means we are going to want to come to our plasma infused assault rifle. Okay, reload and move up. You must be terrified. Yeah. I mean, because there's all these dead bodies around me. I'm afraid they're going to haunt me. Um, what was your assumption there? A few more stim packs. <laughs> oh, you know it's a good day when you walk over windrows of the fallen. Okay, two bottle caps, 16 fusion cells. The Institute is just all kinds of fun. Recon, wait, 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 wait. Where is that? Recon agitated. That recon scope is probably worth it no matter what. Um, may have to drop some other things, but at this point, a laser pistol? Why did I pick that up? And straight up institute rifle. We can drop those. Don't need those. I don't think we're going to be able to sort through everything here. I mean, I would take the rest of the video. And, uh... Recon, recon something, overcharged institute pistol. Those recon scopes. Just awesome. It's a real shame these guys aren't carrying like fat men. Don't you want to bet there's like a world of more synths waiting at the top of the elevator now? Make for an interesting exit strategy of some sort. Not sure what sort. I guess the sort that is, uh, as long as my ammo holds out, sort. And perhaps a, a running battle to the transmitter teleportation pad thing. Oh, I got some more 556. That's always handy. How many levels did we pick up doing this? At least five, I'm guessing.
and not like low levels either I mean not 110 or 112 or anything but in the 40s that's pretty respectable oh my goodness yeah this would take this would take a lot of work well let's see what's behind door number one Oh, they're not going to let me go back? Oh, they are going to let me go back. The elevator was just in the wrong place. I am just digging myself in deeper now, aren't I? Oh, don't look so sad, little Sean robot. I'm sure there will be a couple of other little robot children for you to play with when the day is done. Well, I guess we could use it to go out, but other than that, there's really no reason to hack back through that door. We can just use the regular elevator. Well, what's through here? Oh, well, we can hack through this one. Let's see. Um, oh, we're, we're just on a different floor. Well... I guess we did want to hack through that door anyway. Huh. It's like there was some sort of battle in here. Astonishing. And some of the bits and pieces fell through the floor below. It makes this little skirmish look so <laughs> pale in comparison now. Oh, nice. Some stim packs there. And, oh. Well, then. Got one leg damaged. Both arms are out. I wonder if all those synths in the basement were there because they thought that would be the only way I could get out. Hmm. Well, you know what happens when you assume a guy in power armor uh, annihilates your entire population. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hmm. Oh, here we go. And, well, let's see if there's anyone waiting upstairs. This could get a little tricky without the fat man. What do we have? A lot of, a lot of institute weaponry, all of a sudden. Strange as that is. Okay, and off we go. Back down into stealth just to be on the safe side since we're not coming out with any nuclear alpha strikes on the uh, unsuspecting synths should there be any oh no but somebody did clean up I guess you can only have so many dead synths in a room. We can check these guys over and see if they have anything cool. There's not that many left. Well... I think we got the point across that disturbing an old man's sleep isn't the best idea and shooting his wife is probably even worse so let's fire up the transmitter and see what the outside world has to say wait how do we do that
No, we just walk over here. Wonder where we'll come out. Probably in the Institute grounds, as opposed to, you know, where we came from. But we shall see. Completed, institutionalized, and we leveled up again. That is, it has just been a busy day. Or, well, you know, in game day anyway. Talk to Preston Garvey about the Institute. So shall it be done. Preston will be like, I got word from an Institute that there was a guy whacking everything inside. May need you to go do something about it. Is that a raider right there? No. Looks like one. Doesn't behave like one, though. Okay. So, Preston, Garvey. First, let's hit the old red rocket because we are carrying, oh, so much stuff. Some of it we can sell at some point. I should probably repair the armor, too, before we try to go very... Nick! Nick's hanging out in the rocket. Got some armor. Here, let's just uh, put all our Institute stuff in here for now. We can sort through it later. Recon. Hmm. Well, that's a bit of a difference. Let's hang on to that recon with 75 damage. Just to take a look at at some point. Put in our institute clothes that we picked up. Okay, now let's drag this poor battered... Nick? Is that Nick making that kind of high-pitched whine sound? Never noticed that before. Okay, and... I'm gonna run some diagnostics. Gonna leave the keys in for right now. Repair. 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 Repair and oh, equip, repair, equip, and repair. So everything should be good as new. Outstanding. And Hop right on back in. And the core is low. Imagine that. There is our guest in the mechanist outfit. Gonna need to gather up some more fat men though. I know just the place to pick up a couple, but... The old uh, federal ration stockpile. Is that what it was called? I still do need to build this place up. That might become just a little more necessary now. Preston! Preston? Preston. Hmm. There we I've go. I've made my choice. The Institute is now our enemy. I always knew that day was coming. The question now is what are we going to do about them? Um, do you have a broom and a dustpan? Because it's what we're going to need. Ah. <sighs> I 
say we attack. Take the fight to the Institute. I'm all for that. But we don't have any way to hit them yet. You should give Sturt. Um, where where are you, Preston? Were you bored with the conversation, Preston? Are you upset because I haven't asked you about any settlements lately? Hey there. We'd better discuss what to do about the Institute. If you stand still, we'll do that. I say we attack. Take the fight to the Institute. I'm all for that. But we don't have any way to hit them yet. You um... should give Sturgis that holotape with the Institute data on it. With any luck, he can use it to find some way in. In the meantime, we can focus on building up our strength while Sturgis is working his end. No half measures. This time, when we attack, we finish the job once and for all. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. You got it, Preston. I think we still actually have a settlement to turn into them, but we got out of that conversation without any more busy work. So let's just sneak our stealthy, stealthy power armor self over to Sturgis. Mama Murphy! Sturgis, buddy! Here's that holotape you gave me. Full of Institute data. And maybe some well, bits of well, things. Right. I'll start digging into this and see if I can make heads or tails of it. Sweet! Find a way to attack way it. To bring the fight to them. Let's hope we got something we can use. Well, they sure aren't gonna fall for that teleport hijacker trick twice. Even if it wasn't a smoking pile of scrap metal. <sighs> All the good stuff on here is gonna be encrypted. So the first job is to see if I can crack it. After that, well, I'll have to see what I've got. There's no telling what we might have grabbed off their mainframe. Okay, so... All that is good. Let's take a quick look at our... So I guess five levels. Because I think I'd actually used up everything. Science! Science wouldn't hurt. Nuclear physicist would be really kind of nice, too. Fusion cores last an extra 25% longer, but it looks like I may not. No, I am smart enough. Let's see here. Rifleman. Hey, we can cap that. Confirmed. Should probably think about these guys, too. Maybe a couple points in Heavy Gunner and a couple points in Demolition Expert. Just in case we get into any more of those. Um, oh, Nick was with me. I, I thought Nick was still hanging out at the rocket. But I forgot, they just can't come into the Institute. Okay, Nick, we are going to the Lonely Chapel. Why, you might ask? Because we need some more Fat Man Rounds. Mini Nukes. For the Institute Masses. It is Nick making that little noise. I can't say as I recall that from earlier, but... Maybe the sound levels have balanced differently. Muffled polymer combat armor. Okay. And a federal ration stockpile. Here we come. Should be at least two, maybe three in here. Unless I've picked it over more recently than I think. Wow, they're paying attention today. More than they usually would. That's true. There was a turret, but it is no longer there. Okay, cut this noise. Something out there. Yes, Nick, that is true. Yeah, that gunfire was probably just folks having fun. Mentats and Psycho. Wrench. Nuka Cherry, Jet and Mentats. U.S. Covert, oper covert Operations Manual. Permanently more difficult to detect while sneaking. Sweet! 
Not enough folks value keeping the old CPU sharp anymore. 1450 caliber rounds, 2308 rounds, stim pack, tactical hunting rifle, nuclear material, 6556 rounds, and two fuses. We'll take all of that. Sleepy turret is sleepy and did not wake up in time to do anything to us. Four shotgun shells, 945 rounds, 838 rounds, Radex and Wonder Glue. Okay, you can stop making that noise now. All right, we'll go, we'll go. Oh, sorry, folks, I didn't have the light on. Can't take me anywhere. Only one round down, but... Uh-oh, have I been through here recently? Nine shotgun shells. Looks like I may have been 22 bottle caps 38 or 10 38 rounds if I was I didn't pick it clean so here we have our first mini nuke hooray okay and tin can that's not what I wanted but I guess I'll take it anyway a couple of nuka quantums Okay, there should be a Fat Man launcher here that is going to equate to another um, No, interesting. I thought it would it Only shows this one round though Now, ooh, ooh, ooh Aluminum, always valuable Seven five five six rounds, fuse, vacuum tube. And we'll just head out this way since we're here. I'm sorry, I'm so what? Handsome? You are absolutely right. What the? What the? Who's he? What's it? Nick, did you open the door for the turret? Nick, you should know better. The turrets have to stay outside. Someone's coming. I don't mm, think nope. we're alone. Dun dun dun. Okay, I really shouldn't be using that. Okay. Actually, let's see here. Let's try this. Maybe it can see what Nick sees. I do not. Mainly looking at the Institute pistol because it has so many rounds compared to everything else that we've got. Okay. May not be quiet, but it's got a lot of ammo. And they already know we're here, so... Seriously? That was your plan, dog? Run at the guy that was shooting you? Okay, where's this one? Probably over there somewhere. There we go. Okay. 
Nick, you're doing great. You keep their attention, and I'll keep shooting them. So, not quite as many mini nukes as I would prefer, but more than we had. And can't really beat that. Okay. And we're back out in the world, ready to throw the might of the Minutemen into sweeping up the Institute with brooms and dustpans. It shall be glorious. Hey, there is a suit of power armor hanging out right here. And it's got a core in it. We're going to grab that right on out. So the T-51 frame, chest, and arm don't walk away without us. That would be very inhospitable, unfriendly. But, oh, I burned a whole one out. Oh, well, it happens. Let's grab the 556 out of this turret. Military-grade circuit board and a fuse to go with it. And don't particularly need any of that. Wait, the dog had a muzzle? What was what was it gonna do? Lick me? Seriously, it has a muzzle. Spiked muzzle. I totally misunderstood that dog's intentions. Can't take me anywhere. Jet! Okay, well. Here we are. We've taken the federal ration stockpile. We have exited the Institute after some more significant battling. We've raised some of our perks and acquired another mini nuke. All in all, a pretty good day, I would say. And we're at war with the Institute. The sun is high in a cloudy blue sky. And we're ready to roll for next time. Nick? I swear, sometimes I really don't know where he gets these weapons. I'm guessing this is a combat shotgun that's been tricked out a little bit. Anyway, I uh, would like to point out that if you look in the upper right-hand corner, you will see a small letter I with a white circle around it. These are cards and links to other videos that I've made. Also, I have a Twitter link in the description of the video and on my channel main page. If you're on mobile, it'll be on my channel about page. I would like to thank you guys for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe just a little informative. I would also like to thank you for being the best community out there because truly you guys are awesome and I really do appreciate that. You make this an absolute joy. Thank you. I would also like to invite you to subscribe, like, and share if you so desire and ask you, above all, to please, please, Take care.